Hello and welcome to this presentation about the Berkshire labour market. This presentation is aimed at young people making decisions about future careers. It aims to provide some food for thought and give some facts and figures. The area covered within this presentation is referred to as Thames Valley Berkshire. This area stretches from Hungerford in the west to Slough in the east and includes the areas of Newbury, Reading, Maidenhead, Wokingham, Bracknell and Windsor. This first slide shows how many people are currently employed in different sectors of the economy in Berkshire. We see that the sector with the largest number of people employed is ICT or Digital Technologies. In fact, 14% of the Berkshire workforce work in this sector compared to only 4% of the national workforce. Those work in this, working in this sector mainly work in IT specialist roles. However, a large number also work in sales and marketing roles and in project management roles. Other sectors of the Berkshire economy that employ large numbers of people include the professional and scientific sector, the retail sector, the education sector and the health sector. There are a large number of big name employers in Berkshire. Many of these are international companies. In fact, there are more international companies in Berkshire than elsewhere in the UK outside of London. Many jobs within these companies provide the opportunity for overseas travel. The logos li listed here are of companies employing the largest number of people within Berkshire. We can see that these range from IT and telecoms companies to the public sector and the education sector. Much is said about the importance of science, engineering, maths and technology skills. These skills are arguably more important in Berkshire than elsewhere in England. 27% of all jobs in Berkshire are classified as STEM jobs compared to 22% across England as a whole. 10% of these are classified as core STEM jobs. These are jobs in which science, engineering, maths and technology skills are critically important. This slide lists the main core STEM roles that exist and you can see that they are, can be grouped into three broad areas, science, engineering and IT. As well as considering the occupation or sector that you'd like to work in, it's also interesting to think about the type of organisation you might want to work for, whether that's a public sector, private sector or voluntary sector organisation, a large global company or a small startup, or perhaps you're interested in working for yourself. 68% of jobs in Berkshire are in small or medium sized companies. These are companies employing fewer than 250 people. 14% of people in Berkshire are self-employed. Many people who are self-employed come to self-employment later on in life. Sectors in which young people are more likely to be self-employed include construction, hairdressing and the arts. The majority of the Berkshire workforce work in the private sector, around 80%. The remainder work in the public sector. This includes the NHS, schools, local government and the emergency services. Here we have a list of the jobs that are in highest demand in Berkshire. This is measured by the number of vacancies currently being advertised. Software developers and engineers, and engineers top the list, followed by sales representatives, computer support specialists, network engineers and architects architects and registered general nurses. Generally speaking, IT and sales roles dominate the lists of jobs in highest demand. One in 10 jobs in Berkshire are IT specialist roles. This is three times the national average. This slide here gives a sense of the number of jobs available in different sectors and occupations the level of competition for these jobs and some employers that provide these jobs. 
The number of local job opportunities in different sectors and occupations does vary consider considerably. We can see that there are approximately 50,000 jobs in IT and software development. Whereas at the other end of the scale, there are very few jobs in areas such as veterinary, psychology and computer games design. In IT, whilst there are a lot of jobs, the skills required are very specific and therefore employers can struggle to fill roles. Job positions that employers in Berkshire find most difficult to fill include engineers, social workers, chefs, waiting and bar staff, software developers, lorry drivers, health workers, teachers and apprentices. This slide here provides some quotes from local employers on jobs that they find difficult to fill. Salaries in Berkshire are the highest in the country outside of London. Some high paying jobs in Berkshire that you might not be aware of include business analysts, IT architects and systems designers, quantity surveyors, civil engineers, transport and distribution managers, garage managers and owners, among others. Many of these re require STEM skills. It's worth bearing in mind that while starting salaries can be low in some sectors such as hospitality, retail and warehousing, it is often possible to rise quickly up the ranks within these sectors and therefore increase salaries. Approximately a quarter of Berkshire employers who recruit school leavers believe they are poorly prepared for work. Of these, 12% believe that young people have a poor attitude or lack motivation. So whilst most people don't think this, a fair chunk do. The main employability skills Berkshire employers are looking for are listed here. They include timekeeping, personal organisation, honesty and integrity, good work ethic, reliability and team working. By far the main general skill that employers in Berkshire and in the rest of the country are looking for is good communication skills. What activities could you undertake to improve yours? Other general skills, and by that we mean skills that are find in, found across a wide range of sectors and roles that Berkshire employers are looking for include written, good written English, project management skills, planning and organisation skills, problem solving, being detail orientated, Microsoft Excel skills and teamwork skills. Specialist skills are skills that tend to be found in certain occupations. Computer programming skills, sales and business management skills are the main specialist skills being sought by Berkshire employers. Computer programming skills include the use of programming languages such as JavaScript and SQL. Looking to the future, according to the World Economic Forum, the 10 skills you need to have to have a successful career in 2020 are complex problem solving, critical thinking, creativity, people management, coordinating others, emotional intelligence, judgment and decision making, service orientation, negotiation and cognitive flexibility. An exercise could be to investigate what some of these terms mean and think how you might develop these skills. Over half of jobs in Berkshire require mid-level qualifications. These mid-level jobs include hotel and catering managers, chefs, teaching assistants, office managers, electricians, IT support technicians, social care roles, health care roles, lorry drivers, estate agents, business sales executives and retail workers. Currently only a third of residents have their highest qualification at, at this level. Mid-level includes five good GCSEs to three A levels or equivalent.
And finally, this slide provides figures on the number of employers offering apprenticeships in Berkshire. Nearly 2,500 Berkshire employers offer apprenticeships. Advanced apprenticeships are more popular in Berkshire than nationally. Across the Berkshire area, more employers in Reading and West Berkshire offer apprenticeships than in the other local authority areas. And finally, this last slide provides some links to places where you might wish to go for further careers information, labour market information or information about apprenticeships. If you have any general queries about the information in these slides, please contact Caroline Perkins using the details at the bottom of this last slide.